Can you build a deck out of only one booster box? Well, let's find out. I challenged top four Brisbane regionals and 04 Drop It Worlds player Joshua Sparks to go against me, CEO of Needs to Clean His Sleeves, in a best of one battle using cards only obtained in a booster box. So we have two booster boxes of the newest set, Stellar Crown, and we'll be forced to use exclusively the cards that we obtain out of each of our booster boxes to construct a 60 card standard deck. However, it won't be that simple, as I've cooked up a devious punishment for whoever loses. And to make it even better, I haven't even told Josh what the punishment is yet. You see, whoever wins this battle will be choosing the loser's deck list for the next official competitive tournament. This means that either of us could be forced to play anything from a theme deck to a super spicy list, all depending on how brutal the winner wants to be. Now, Stellagram features some really strong cards like Terrapagos EX, Noctowl, and Briar. But as a whole, the set doesn't feature too many playable cards. So it's gonna be really interesting to see what each of us cook up for our two different decks. So let's jump into it. Let's do this, brother. <laughs> all right, all right. You ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Yes. All right, what I box? want the one that you gave me. Okay. Well, no pressure. Do you want the scissors? I actually kind of do. I was that was probably my biggest fear was that I actually can't open anything. So especially yeah. Pokemon. Well, I mean I'm gonna be like pacing through these packs. Like on go. You'll be like <laughs> I'm gonna be finished these boxes. You'll finish the box and I'll be like yeah. my third pack in. Like, oh look at these pretty cards. Right. Whoever pulls the most expensive card gets win the flip automatically for our game. I like that. whoever got the most expensive card. Alright, All right, let's do it. Good luck, brother. Oh, oh, do you like <laughs> It's the big no. dragon. It's the big dragon. Alright, it's so looking, it's not going off oh, to a great start. Oh! I'm winning. Okay. The store, that's actually pretty huge. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh brother, oh, brother. Oh, oh. I thought it, it was him. He got excited, he got excited. I thought excited. it was him. Oh, it's the same dude. It's the same bad guy. You know what's funny? There's no Ivasaur in the set. It's Snow Red King, so... Yep. So you're not playing that Venusaur. Oh, oh, oh! Oh. The warm. The warm. Terrapios, Terrapios, please. Cinderace, bro. <laughs> yeah, I think that's probably me cooked, I reckon. <laughs> I think I don't think I'm getting a Terrapios. <laughs> sorry, sorry, where's your where are your Terra Pokemon? Yeah, exactly. Right that's here? what I'm saying. I don't have any. Oh, oh, you're speaking of Terra Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> speaking of Terra Pokemon. Oh. Even then though, like from all the boxes that I open, it seems like you never get a full play set of any. This is the strat right now. Okay. And that's what we're going to play. And we're going to win by playing. Oh, uh, another, another bulk one. What does if it you do? flip a coin, <laughs> does a hundred more damage. Have you so read the metal, metal? In the bin, isn't it? Oh, Gulpin! Oh, favorite, favorite art. I might have a cool. Oh, we're just getting all the starters today. Look at that. I think art. you've definitely got the most expensive card, either the Bulbasaur or the Squirtle. I think that. Frick, like, come on! <laughs> <laughs> you got the Bulbasaur and the Squirtle. I got the Blastoise and the Venusaur. <laughs> Bro. Oh! It's a Crispin. It's a cr Oh, that's actually <laughs> sick. Oh, great. I'm oh, I got the second. Are you kidding? Right, these, the borders look exactly the same. Yeah. You know, I'm pulling the absolute freaking heat. Yeah. Or, or I've got nothing. a Cinderace here. Yeah, or I've got a Cinderace. I'm not going to lie. This probably Ooh. isn't, this probably isn't a reader's finest moment. <laughs> They're abominable. I mean... I get what they're trying to do with it, with the abominable snowman, like just out in the winter. But also, I like seeing my cards. Yeah, like, but like, there, if you look at that for a second, there's not a Pokemon on that card. No. The oh, first. I finally got an Ace back. Oh, oh. Be the crystal. Oh. No tree. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he gets the bomb. He gets the, the bomb. bomb. He gets the bomb. No, I'm so gassed. Oh, I yeah. love that. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So happy with I that. could never be happier. Sorry, I might get I've got three packs left, I might get another one. You're never gonna expect the twelve damage of slide that on. What the Good stooge. I don't even know where mine is. There it is. <laughs> Good stooge. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I didn't even mention it because it's so, <laughs> it's so, <laughs> so, <laughs> so <laughs> Hey you got another Kofu. Sparkling oh, crystal. crystal I'm actually kind of here for that. That's good, that's gas. I mean well. I definitely think you're uh, you're picking first or second. <laughs> <laughs> two ace specs, you can get oh. one or two. Hey, he's in trouble now. I'm a good boy. Oi, <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> how did I get stooge so hard? How, like, did, how did I get this gas? What is going on right now? This might actually be the first box that I've ever opened that I've plus on. When I got this and that I was kind of like 
mm, I mm. actually wouldn't mind a grand tree right now. Grand yeah. Tree. Yeah. And then I didn't. So uh So we're not doing Delug's that. bomb. I like the idea of playing Galvantula, but I just don't know how real item locking you is going to be. And yeah. I can't even tell you another item in this set besides yeah. <laughs> glass trumpet. So uh, True. Uh, yeah. Like what actually is another item? Uh tell me. Hold on. I can tell find, me. Tell I can me find one. one. What did I play? Surely there's another no, item. I swear there's zero. one item in this set. Just one item. Yeah, this feels like it's going to be incredibly inconsistent. I'll mm. say that much. Yeah, I think that Trumpet and Fossils may be the only ones. Should we run through what the, the penalty's going to be? Yeah, go on. <laughs> what are you going to do at the end of this? <laughs> <laughs> You're regretting It's not already. crazy. It's not going to be crazy. Okay. The winner gets to choose what deck the loser is going to play at the next challenge. All right. So literally any deck, Bro. cook up the list. <laughs> are, you, are you sure you want to do that? Jeez, I better win this because I actually need that finish right now. After finishing cracking all those packs, it's time to build our decks. I've already got ideas in mind, but I just don't know how heavy to go because I did pull so well. I kind of wish that I didn't so that I had to cook a little bit harder. Roger Gas, what are you going to do? I'm, I'm genuinely just out here sweating. Yeah, I've got like five different piles of just like, yeah, that's Maybe, yeah. vaguely relevant to what I've got here. Yeah. <laughs> like, Is there anything that draws cards? I know Celebi has collect. I'm actually like thinking I'll just have like one <laughs> Celebi in the list because I don't think there's enough going on at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like... Well, not enough here. Now. now, out of my booster box, I managed to pull together a deck that vaguely revolves around Cinderace EX, which I'm planning to use against Josh's deck to deal massive damage and hopefully steamroll his entire board. But due to Cinderace being a stage two, it does mean it's going to be pretty difficult for me to actually get it online. So I've had to throw in a whole bunch of other Pokemon to assist me in the early game to give me a couple of turns to actually set up my big bunny. As for Josh, he was very lucky to snag the Terrapagos EX, which with Glass Trumpet being one of the only item cards in the entire set, Josh is primed to use all of these cards together to help power up this Terrapagos and potentially make it an unstoppable force on the board. So with our decks built, it's time to battle. You definitely got the most expensive yeah. card out of the box, so... <laughs> uh, I'm just trying to work out. I've been thinking about it for a while now. I don't know whether going first or second is better. I think we're going second. Which feels crazy considering you are definitely playing an evolution deck because you got <laughs> nothing else. <laughs> or he's either attacking with Buffalo or he's playing evolution. So it feels crazy to do that. But yeah, I will say I was really scraping. <laughs> oh, the bulk is in. All right, best of luck. Did he play a one-off? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. And he's got the rope. <sighs> That's madness. Wait, does that mean you have Noctowl in hand as well? This is immense. I want you to understand just how crazy this is. This is a joke. I'm going to lose this. After all of all of the talk. Fire. He is playing the center race. Pass. All right. No score money. We're safe. Oh, that is a top deck. All right. Um, we are going to fan call. We are going to grab target. Yep. Not the Terrapagos brother. Yours. Yep. That. So I'm going to start out with a, a Kofu. Oh, boggers. Oh no. I really should have read the Cinderace when you pulled it because I have no clue what it does. Oh, he's going to knock me off. <laughs> oh, he's actually going to knock me off. Oh, then I'm going to knock you off. <laughs> Uh, this one here. That one? Yeah. Oh. Alright. Me and Fu Control coming in heat. Knocked out? Yeah. Target. I'm gonna go back in. We will. Chrissy. Or. Target. Yeah. This will go here. This will go to him. Mm -hmm. Power Splash for knockout. Yeah. For 120. Mm -hmm. Oh, bros, thank you. He's got you. He's worried. <laughs> I'm like really getting this right now. I know it's not an item. So he's got him getting like a Pecha, Pechaya Berry or whatever it's called out here. Is he getting the boom burst? <laughs> oh. 
<laughs> so it's if I do more than it, like if it's a, if I do damage at all. Yeah, if this card is attached to be active is damaged by an attack, you put twelve damage counters on the attacking Pokemon. Yeah. I just thought I don't know how I'm gonna like KO a Terrapagos and I was like, oh that like kinda gets like halfway there. <laughs> It's like I'm, I might never even see a Cinderace. I'll oh, probably just. I'm about it, bro. I'll probably just get the freaking bomb and I'll like chuck it on a Celebi collect. Oh, Kofu. The Balooza it actually scares me a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. And you pass. You got two Kofu on the Yeah. Yep. All right, that's a win. That's a that's a good draw. That's a really good draw. We are going to play Boof. Bench myself out. We're going to attach water. Yep. Uh, and we're going to power splash for the knockout. Yep. Oh, he's got another Mianfu. He is actually going Mianfu control. That's crazy. Uh, and then we're hitting uh, Lacey. Just the four cards, brother. <laughs> crazy four right here. Bang. Oh, they're huge. They're actually wild. He's loving it. Uh, we'll Sonic Edge. <laughs> That's how wild they are. Uh, we would go attach. We would go Kofu with one, two. Yep. What are you attacking me with? You're gonna knock off again? I don't think you are. I'm just putting that out there. Uh, all right. We will Laramarine. 18, 19, 20. I don't reveal. It's just look and t attach. All right. We are clearing this deck out. Got that. So that's going to go there. Got that, so that's going to go there, just so that I don't have to do that. I'm going to go those three there. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm going to attach there. Because mm -hmm. I can't, I'd like, I need to find, <laughs> I need to find a dude. I just need a guy. I have some Sydney just twiddling thumbs. Four biggins. Mm -hmm. oh, got a guy. Oh, boot. Got a freaking dude. Uh, and I'll Sonic Edge for knockout. There's no knockout. What? You're 10 short. Oh no, you're not. What do you mean? Damn, you're not 10 short. Okay. That's crazy. I can't, I just can't do math. Put the boofy up. <coughs> boofy boy. And we'll draw for 10. Um, and then we will go. Um, Jewel Seeker. Yep. Grab those two. I'll get back in. Yep. We will play that down. Bench Roadie. Bench Selby. Crispy boy. Right. Those two. Attach there. This one the hand. Yep. And then I will boundless power for knockout and take her. And then I will promote the run. Just come in there. Big L boy. Big L. Big L. Um Yeah. It's looking pretty gas over here, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, he's feeling good. <laughs> I'll whack that on there. That's a filthy play. I'm not about that. <laughs> Play Celebi. Lacey. Yep. Perfect. Flash Trumpet. There. There. Flash Trumpet. Mm -hmm. There. There. I will Assault Landing for 70. Yep. What? Oh, right. My room. <laughs> I was like, oh, yeah, you need to play that to play Medicham, don't you? Yep. And yours. Seven and I'm actually really concerned about this Cinderace because I have no idea what it does. Attach, pass. <laughs> I'm take a freaking Kofu right now. That is keeping it a hundred. Oh man, this is scary. Still don't find a freaking. I'm gonna read it. Lacey. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. Oh yeah, brother. The issue is, I actually thought when I read it that it was if your opponent has exactly one prize card in there. Mm. Which you may as well just take a knockout on that turn, I reckon. Probably the move. Yep. We did not hit it. That's crazy. Um, we are just going into Assault Landing mode for knockout. Yep. I don't think I'm going to have another chance, so I'm going to hit that. Mm -hmm. 
These are getting so much value right now, these trumpets. I've just overthought the absolute wildest things and like played so poorly because of it. <laughs> I feel like I've played you into this game right now. Yeah. I think so. <laughs> Oh, brother! Come on, brother! This is like gonna be a freaking dream and a half out here after this. I'm just gonna play down this guy. Sure. Yeah. Um, and then I'll hit that guy. Evolve. And I will less him. Bench attach. Another one! No, oh, they're both in there. <laughs> Bench attach. And I will crown opal for 180. Yeah. I mean, it's just this, isn't it? What does this Cinderace do? Like, if I just get a Cinderace, like, we're gaining. Like, I can't, like, trumpet or anything, so I just have to pray that I get... <laughs> you hit it, surely. Surely. How much does Cinderace hit for? 280. 280! I can't believe it. <laughs> I have eight cards here. Yeah. And no Pokemon search. Yeah, you got it though. There's two Cinderace in that deck. Yeah, you got this. I was so pissed because I lacied like four turns in a row. Yeah. The first two turns I had Briar in hand mm -hmm. and I was like, could really use this later on. I was you better like, cut that because... No, I don't want to. You've been drawing like crap all game. <laughs> Keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep going. <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> oh. With Josh taking out the win on this one, he sent me across this super interesting deck for me to play at my next league challenge. So make sure you stick around to find out how this abomination performs.